वेलकम बैक टू इंडियन टाइम्स डेली डॉट कॉम एंड द टॉप टेन हेडलाइंस फ्रॉम गुजरात आर अ वीडियो ऑफ फास्ट लीडर हार्दिक पटेल मीटिंग कांग्रेस वाइस प्रेसिडेंट राहुल गांधी हैज बिन वायरल पटेल हैज वेव ऑफ द स्पेक्यूलेशन एंड सेट दैट ही मेट विद कांग्रेस जनरल सेक्रेटरी अशोक गहलोत एंड नॉट गांधी BJP has accused OBC leader Alpesh Thakur of working for Congress Youth Branch earlier. BJP said that the Thakur has dramatized his entry in the Congress and cheated his community. Past leader Varun Patel who has recently joined BJP has accused Hardik Patel of receiving 1 crore rupees from NCP for the former convention. Meanwhile Varun has been praising the BJP party that he once used to criticize. Traders have welcomed the government decision to establish the GIDC in Rajkot. They are hoping that this move would help them recover the loss caused by the demonetization and GST. Deputy Chief Minister Nitin Patel has assured reduction in GST for farmers. Patel also recently announced 50% hike in the salaries of Asha workers. The government has been announcing such fruitful schemes just before when the elections are on the edge. A boating center has been placed on an island in Dwaraka where voters will have to travel in boat to reach and vote. The election committee for the convenience of the voters has decided to place a voting booth within 2 kilometers of their residence. 32,000 CRPF and BSF officers and 55,000 police officers will be deployed on duty for the upcoming election. The security system will get more precise after the 182 seat assembly's term will come to an end on January 23. MP Jashri Patel has attended a snail milan organized by the BJP in Mansa. Patel slammed Congress for making comments on the development of the state and said that the bats cannot see the development even in the daylight. The transport department has delivered a new modern bus to the ST Corporation of Ahmedabad to ease the travelling for people. The bus includes all amenities for safety and emergencies and is also focused on the cleanliness. The Airport Action Committee of Surat has urged to expand the local airport into the international airport. They have complained that Surat is the fourth fastest growing city in the world and yet there is no international airport. This is the end of the news bulletin but stay tuned to indiantimesdaily.com as news from Bollywood is coming up next and do visit the resources section on this portal to find the best Indo Canadian businesses and resources from accounting firms to wedding planners in your city. All of us at Indian Times Daily wish that you have a great day.